Hey anybody, this is Outpacker Patrol. So sorry this video uh, is very short, but my recording software keeps getting screwed up um, the second time now. And, uh, well, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm at Shoal, and I have Epic Fetus. Oh. I have Epic Fetus, I said, uh, which is useful uh, for... No! Oh, that's dangerous. Uh, which is good. Um... My Little Pony. In My Little Pony, it's a good item. And it's probably more useful. Eh, you know, maybe I'll come back for that when I'm about to fight. I'm gonna take damage. I thought for certain I was gonna take damage there. Luckily, it didn't work out that way. Um, so yeah, the game's been completely screwing me over in that it sometimes will decide that I am not allowed to dodge where I want to dodge. Um, which is really annoying. Uh, because... I would love to dodge where I'm trying to dodge, since I'm not even that good at it normally. But uh, the game, you know, it, it's, it's kind of lagging and deciding that I shouldn't have that opportunity. Uh, you know, that's cool. That's cool, I, I understand. It's, uh, it's, it's in the game's best interest to win. Probably. Um, nope, can't, can't hit one of them. Okay, we got, we got the... Bomb, bomb dudes out of the way, so that's really cool. Uh, we'll kill that guy. Oh, we also have the compass and the map, so I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna get, um, My Little Pony, because Book of Revelations, again, is, you know, basically worthless here. I, it's not gonna do anything for me, um, anymore. Uh, and also, that's kind of the reason why I don't have a bunch of blue hearts, is that it would continuously, uh, move me into enemies, when I did not want to go and fight enemies, and uh, and it would uh, take away all my all my blue hearts on on room. So we're gonna fight Satan here. Um, he's uh, not so bad, but uh, this is the first time I fought him technically on camera, and actually technically in this video, I think I mean, in, uh, in this game. Whoa! He wow! He did that quickly. Uh, I haven't fought him in a long time, actually, which scares me a little bit. Uh, I guess I'll just wait for him to stop. You gonna, you gonna stop, bro? Nope. Feeling like you don't wanna- Ah. Oh. Well, at least I poisoned him, I guess, right? Really? Okay, I'm gonna use the, uh, My Little Pony. Do as much damage to Satan as possible. Okay, did some damage. Ah, uh, can't. Okay, kind of hard to dodge when I'm just looking at bullets. Okay, not so bad. Alright, now this may be difficult. This may be difficult. Maybe not the worst thing. Since I can aim my bomb. Uh. Alright, I'm sorry. I'm concentrating here. Uh, bad things. Alright! Yeah! We unlock mom's knife. Fantastic. Okay, so this is going to be a very short video. It won't be the only video that I post today. I mean, I'll, I'll post another one right after this, I'm sure. Um, or maybe I'll tack this on to the beginning of another video. I don't know. I'll figure it out. But, uh, uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I'll, I'll see this ending, because th this ending has never been seen on camera, I don't think. Um, yeah. Awesome. Okay, well, uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. This has been, uh, Alpaca Patrol, signing out. Peace, fools. Hey, anybody, I'm, uh, I'm not gonna do my little intro thing, because, <laughs> uh, most likely I cut this together with, uh, with the end of that Satan fight, since my recording software kept getting screwed up. Uh, but, um, there's no reason for me to play as Isaac anymore, so, I mean, I'm gonna try it with Kane and see if, uh, see if it worked out. Funny story. I actually just tried to do this like seconds ago and, and tried to play as Kane and uh, luckily I got the basement and that's great but uh, but the first the first item uh, that I got was uh, Tech 2 so uh, anyone who's watched my videos knows how completely freaking worthless Tech 2 is on Kane 
Um, and the game likes to troll the shit out of me and, and give me technology to every single time I play as Kane. Every single goddamn time. Uh, so... Okay, Tough Love, that's actually pretty cool. That's, I mean, it's uh, more or less a damage upgrade, uh, which is cool because um, that'll give me a bunch of tooth shots once in a while. Uh, this should be the secret room. And it is. And we got 99 bombs. Okay, awesome. That's, uh, you know, good start. Good start, Kane. So yeah, I mean, now I gotta start beating the game with every character if I want to unlock more items. I did unlock the uh, mom's knife on the last floor, which is great because that's an awesome item. Um, I'm not particularly good with it, but I know the item is in fact good. Alright, we got Pin. I, I, you know, I still, I don't like fighting Pin. I almost, no, I'm not going to say I, I like fighting Widow better now, but I, I, I'm, not a, I'm not a fan of Pin. I really find Pin to be much harder than Skolex. I don't know why. I mean, this, by, by all accounts, this should be the easiest boss in the game. But I guess it's not even really Skolex's, uh, uh, Skolex's patterns that make it super duper easy. It's, it's more of, uh, oh, that was really super stupid. Uh, it's more that, you know, by that point in the game, wow, he killed himself. That's hilarious. Um, mm, the tick is going to lower boss health. But it, I, I can't remove it. Let's see what this is. Luck up. Okay, that's cool. The moon takes us to the secret room. Okay, the tick lowers boss health, which is good, but I can't remove it, so that's bad. And you know what? I'm not going to take it. I'm not going to take it. Um, and I'll go straight to the secret room here. Uh, and we got, wow, slowing effect. That's uh, that's that's really cool. Um, that is that is a great upgrade to get, and I am not going to in any way complain about that. Uh, so yeah, wow. A bunch, of, a bunch of good things happen, starting with Kane here. Um, and actually, that luck up in, a, in accordance, or in addition to having the lucky foot might make uh, my luck be amazing so let's fight Monstro here since I found him um, that's, that's pretty much the only reason I came and fought him I mean I would have went and found the treasure room first but I mean let's be honest we're on the basement too and uh, there are not going to be that many crazy bosses I mean at worst it could be like what Larry Jr and uh, you know that would be kind of bad um, but yeah, I mean, it, it, like, it wouldn't be that bad because it's Larry Jr., obviously. But, I mean, I have taken damage on Larry Jr., which I'm not proud of. I'm not proud of. Let's put that out there. I'm in no way proud of any of that. Oh, what? You jumped in place? Are you kidding? And you took away my whole, my whole blue heart. I guess it's because I slowed him. Uh, hope this is not the, the uh, uh, story of things to come. Okay, Jesus Juice, that's good, um, it, uh, again, I prefer a health up because it's pretty much needed with uh, characters like this that start off with lower health, uh, otherwise things could get bad very quickly, um, and I don't want that to happen because we started off with some really good upgrades here, um, and I would, I would, I would really like this run to be successful. Now, here's a question. I guess, it, you know, it depends. Because um, I haven't beaten Satan with, I think, any of the characters. So, when I, if, if I get far enough that I can have the choice between, uh, uh, if I can have the choice between the Cathedral and Shoal, where should I go? Should I go to Shoal? Because it's potentially easier than the Isaac fight? You know, I guess it's very situational. Like, if I have a lot of health and I, I don't do a lot of, um, like, speedy damage, then I think uh, fighting Isaac would probably be better. But if it's just any other scenario, I think fighting Satan would probably be better because Satan uh, largely is not super, super difficult to the boss. Although it's probably just because I, you know, know his patterns pretty well. But... You know, he's, he's not he's not terrible. I mean, it's, it's the fallen, and then it's uh, a reasonably easy, easily dodgeable uh, shooting phase, and then after that, oh, I thought that tooth was totally gonna hit him. Uh, umbilical cord. Okay, I, I don't know what this does. I think it's something good. <laughs> I assume spiders. Oh, blue hearts. You are just you 
you're just loving me today, game. I, I, I like that. Well, not today. I mean, I've been recording a couple videos. It is not loving me today. But it has uh, been been good to me so far. Um, I don't know what that is. Well, I mean, I guess I'm going to pick it up. I don't have the D6. Ghost Baby. Okay, so... Oh, right. You know, I got, I've gotten this before. Okay, so basically it's just going to have uh, Spectral Tears. Oh, what am I doing? I mean, I have 90, 98 bombs. I should be looking for every secret room and picking up everything that crap my rocks. Um, so I guess I already went in there. I don't even remember what was in there. Well, whatever. I'm sure it was something good. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look for, for everything here and, and pick up all this stuff. I totally forgot that I had Pyro. Um... I'm, I'm gonna look for the super secret room because eh, it can only be in a few places on this floor, really. Um, that obviously not being one of them. And, uh, you know, it, it, it could give me something really, really good. Um, it could even be a fortune teller, which might not give me the worst thing. Um, because then I could potentially get blue hearts, I could potentially get the crystal ball, which would be a freaking fantastic upgrade to get so early. Um, I already checked there, I think. So it can only be here, which is uh, doubly useful since I can get that money. Indeed it is. Uh, spiders. Troll bombs. Okay. See, when you, when you don't set your, 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 your standards or your goals high, you're never disappointed. Story of my life, man. Story of my life. Uh, this just took a turn for the depressing. Uh, I don't like these guys. I don't like any of his... Ah, uh, get out of there! Um... Yeah. And is it a range down? Luck up. Oh, okay. It was a range down in my last run that, that uh... Oh, that you, that you will see, because, uh, right, the Satan fight will be just before this video, most likely. Book Shadows? Okay. Um, that's not, a, that's not, like, an amazing item, but, uh... I mean, it is good if you don't have anything else, which I don't, so, uh... So I can explain about that. Um, I should try to use these guys to open up that red chest for me, but honestly, I have 88 bobs, and doing that will probably get me almost killed. Um, so I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna push my luck here. That's nine lives. I'm not gonna pick that up. Fuck nine lives, seriously. Nine lives can blow me. Uh, and we'll, we'll go fight this boss. All right, we got pestilence. Um, that ain't so bad. I will use Book of Shadows if I get into like a really dangerous situation, dangerous situation being like I'm stuck behind the rocks and there's nothing I can do with take damage. Uh, almost there. Almost there. Was necessary there. Yep. Okay. Oh, I'll just hammer away at him then since, uh, since I got Book of Shadows going. Um, it's alright though. You know. I mean, I didn't take any damage and that's, that's better than uh, taking damage. Oh, fantastic! All right, we got a health up, and we can fly now. Glorious, glorious day. Oh, I almost took. Whoa, that would have been that would have been bad, man. I'd have been very angry if I accidentally took nine lives after I got such a great such a great upgrade. So I'll have to remember that nine lives is there. Let's check the uh, super secret rooms here. Are the regular secret rooms there. Nope. All right, whatever. No biggie. I'm not gonna get that because I don't have enough keys to make that uh, entirely efficient. Um, it might be co-efficient though. <laughs> math joke, not really. I mean, I just said something that was a math term. I'm uh, I'm hating on myself today. Uh, blow up this. Hey, look at that. That's the regular secret room. Yeah, I thought that was the regular secret room. Okay. That's cool, because uh, that means once we find the shop, we're going to have enough money to go to that shop. So I'm, I'm, I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that having money and not having, like, spider bite or something awesome. Okay, so I'm going to use... Uh, I'm going to let Ghost Baby deal with this, because uh, I think it was in a video that was here. Wow, Book of Revelations. Okay. I see you, baby. Shaking that ass. Uh, glorious. Uh, that's, that's fantastic. I'll pick that up. Death, that's a good card. Um, let's see, super secret room? Are you here? I think it's here. Yeah. I think I checked everywhere else. Okay, nothing in there. I mean, not nothing. I mean, it's, it's good. Uh, and there's no heart machines on the floor, so... We'll keep going. Wow, this, this, this run's starting off pretty good, unless I accidentally pick up nine lives in this room. 
You were you were grinding your teeth waiting for that, weren't you? Uh, all right, so now we are on the Caves 2, which is awesome because it's not the Catacombs 2, which means it should be at least in some factor or another slightly easier than uh, than where I was. Now, what would be a great item right now for me to get is the 9 volt. Like, if I could find a Judgment Bomb and he could drop the 9 volt for me, that would be great. So I could keep uh, amassing a huge stack of blue hearts, uh, because that would make my life a million years easier. Um, I, don't, I don't know if it would translate into years, really. I suppose if, if we were talking about light, oh, that was bad, then it could be, I guess. I don't know what I'm talking about, man. I'm looting. I, uh, I got a, I got a bunch of, bunch of bad things happen to me. Oh, I probably could have picked up more things on that floor once I could fly. Whatever. I don't really care. Um, I didn't even check. It's kind of lagging out a little bit. Oh, this is, this room is, uh, with their alternating fire rate, it's making it very difficult to hit them. Okay. Yeah, see, they're, they're alternating their fire, which, which makes my life a little bit easier, I mean harder. Uh, and, you know, that's definitely not as good as making it easier, obviously. Um, I hate fighting these guys. I think they're called plots. They suck, man. Oh, health up. That is awesome. Yeah, right, Kane, luck. Yeah, no pills can be bad for Kane. Oh, and this, uh, I was about to say, this room is normally bad, but it's not bad with, with uh, flying. But, uh, you know, whenever I, whenever I talk shit about the game, it, uh, it just puts me firmly in my place. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with that. Oh, the fool. Well, you know what? I'm going to take death in here. I'm going to fight this boss, whoever it is. All right, we got Chad. I mean, with uh, with Book Revelations, he's, his upgrade is going to be borderline useless. But um, I don't think I've ever fought Chad on camera. So, um, you know, maybe maybe you'll get to see an... Uh, Maybe if you've never seen the game or don't have the game, you will get to see a boss that is uh, reasonably new to you. So uh, I'm, I'm happy about that, at least. In the very least. Um, so Chad gets smaller and faster uh, as you kill him, more so. Also, uh, interesting thing to note, uh, he was a boss in Super Boy. Did I get hit? I didn't even see it. I heard the getting a hit sound. I didn't see what I got hit by, nor did I see the me getting hit flat. I don't know. Maybe I'm just going crazy, man. The game's been screwing me for the past while, and uh, maybe that's what's happening. I'm just I'm just starting to hallucinate that the game is, is doing bad things. All right, so again, we got little Chad. He's gonna give half hearts. I mean, that's good. That is always good. Uh, I'm gonna use. Nah, I'm not gonna. Yeah, I am. I'm lazy. Uh, I'm going to use the fool so that I can skip back here. Um, even though I probably should keep the death card just in case I run into a room that's really crappy. But, uh, I don't know. And with flying, it's kind of hard to run into a room that is legitimately really crappy. Because you can mostly get out of any situation uh, because of the flying. Yeah, like like this room is, is a joke. I mean, unless, unless I get really dumb and just chill in this corner here. Eh, I guess even, not even... But hey, I'm not complaining about uh, making the game easier, because uh, my lag in the last video where I beat Satan is certainly making the game harder. Alright, so that's the boss horde room. I'm not going to go in there, because, you know, why would I? Kill a single Larry Jr., uh, kill a second Larry Jr., and that's a health up. Oh, boners, boners all day. Boners just all day, all over the place. Yeah, this boat can't be bad. Speed up, awesome. Uh, let's go see what's in here. Lard, okay. Yeah, that's actually great that I just got that speed up because that's going to give me two extra health ups. And it's going to slow me, but I just got that, that that speed up, so, like, you know, whatever, man. I don't even know why I came in here. Probably because I'm dumb. But, uh, you know, whatever. This room is not that hard when you don't have to worry about the spikes. Or, you know, if the guy decides to sit up. There we go. Come on, buddy. There you go. There you go. Just sit up to die. I always feel like uh, Kurt Russell in Big Trouble in Little China when I try to do that Minnesotan voice. Uh, I, I don't do it very well, obviously. But, uh, but uh, I try my best. 
I try my best at all my voices. Umbilical cord. Oh man, I, I, don't, I don't know what umbilical cord does. Um, pinky eye gives me poison shots every once in a while. Is that better than what umbilical cord's doing? I mean, I'm getting some good stuff here. I, I feel like I don't know what umbilical cord does. It could be doing some great things for me, and I'm just not paying attention to it. So I'm gonna keep it. I, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna let the 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 show ride on, on what what what's been working so far. So um, yeah. Ah. Epic fetus. Do do we want another epic fetus video? Is that what the uh, world is asking for? You know what? No. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. You know why I'm not going to do it? Because last time I did that, uh, my game, like, lagged out super hard, and I couldn't hit anything, and it would glitch me into things, and I got super frustrated, and it was awful. Uh, so I am done with you, Epiphetus, or at least for this little while here. Uh, I was actually really hoping for uh, money in that, in that secret room. I mean... Ugh, should I turn off, turn out, turn down a great upgrade? It really is a very good upgrade. I'm looking for the super secret room so that I can figure out what I want to do here. So that I can bide my time and figure out... I mean, like, I feel like you guys maybe get bored of Epic Fetus. Like, maybe, um... Maybe you don't like seeing it over and over again because... I mean, I've seen it in almost every one of my videos recently, and uh, and it is no different than the the video that introed this video, where I had Epic Fetus. So I don't know, man. I. Uh, I mean, I can't turn down an upgrade. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna hope that the game doesn't. Oh, screw me over. Um. And, uh, here's hoping, right? I mean, it doesn't seem... Oh, it's starting. Okay, no, we're good. No, all right, yep, it's starting. It's starting. It's starting to lag me out and not give me, uh, movement, my freedom of movement. I should have listened to my, my early better judgment. Oh, gosh darn it. Again, it's lagging out my mouse, too, and, and shooting it more times than I... Yep, see, it's doing that. And I didn't, I didn't fire. Oh, this this could have been a terrible decision that ends a a at once fantastic run. All right, so the secret room could be anywhere in this floor. Yep, it's lagging me out. It's lagging me out, and it's it's, it's restricting my movements. Oh man. Okay, we got uh, brother Bobby, which you know borderline useless in the fetus. Alright, I'm gonna try my best to not get as frustrated as I did last time because I got really frustrated with not being able to move. Just roll with the punches, man. I'll just roll with the punches. If I can't move and it screws me over, then that's my own fault for taking I could've I could've I could've turned it down, you know? I could have said no. I could have said no, I could beat us, but I just didn't have the uh, I didn't have the willpower to turn down such a such a powerful upgrade. Especially when you're using the mouse. Because it is so much easier to aim. Um, and we're also on the necropolis, which scares me. Oh, yep, see? It just did it there. I didn't want to move halfway through the room. Um, but, but it decided that I should. Ah, this is scaring me. Ah, that was actually really dumb. That was just bad dodging on my part. Um, almost bad dodging again, but things worked out. Okay. Awesome. Oh, I didn't even see that guy. Oh, and I didn't mean to drop that bomb either. But, whatever. Not like it matters. Not like I need bombs for anything. Oh, jeez. Oh, yep, nope. This is a bad room to take away my movement from. Yep, no, I'm trying to move, trying to move. Oh, screw everything, man. I'm trying to look for the secret room because I don't know if Curse of the Lost means that there is no secret room or that um, it's not in its usual place. I think I read on the wiki that it's not in its usual place, but uh, I, I don't I don't know, man. I, I, I've, I've got no clues. No clues are had here. 
So I don't know. I mean, next time I find Epic Fetus, I may just not pick it up. Because, I mean, what, uh, what purpose does it have except for screwing me over here? I mean, obviously, it's, it's making rooms a lot easier than they would be normally. But I mean, I don't know. You know what? Tell me in the comments, if you could, whether or not you guys like seeing me pick up Epic Fetus over and over again. If, if, it's, getting, if it's getting boring, then I will stop doing so. Uh, but it is a great upgrade. Oh, a library. Oh, well, I have the book of Revelations. What other, what other book could I possibly want? Actually, what I do want is I would love to be able to find the secret room and get some money. Uh, because... Again, getting a, getting a battery or like a 9 volt or something, that would be very useful right now with this book of revelations. I'm just saying, I'm going to keep that around uh, just in case there's a lot of heart drops. Uh, I know there's a few. Aww. Damn you, white flies! Man, those white flies make this room more difficult than it should be. Oh, awesome. Um, but now I just need a freaking key in my life. Well, I'll play this until 15 cents. Just in case I get a key. All right, well, I guess I'll play it more than what I anticipated. Because I'm hoping for a key. If I can get a key, then I'll probably go to the shop. Um, and if the shop doesn't have anything good, where does greed? I mean, greed wouldn't be so bad either, because then I'd have enough money to go to the shop on the next floor. Um, Come on, Key. Do me a solid here. Pretty fly's good. I'm not going to complain about that. Okay, well, we'll keep exploring. If anything, I will keep... Um, if we don't find a key, if we get some more money, I'll go play that a little bit more. Fortune Teller. Alright, well, that's another thing that I could use in case... Oh, dang it, I didn't even see those Zelda things. And he killed himself, which is awesome. You know what, I'll fight this boss. Uh, okay, we got War, which is going to give me the second Meat Boy. Oh! <laughs> See, it, it, it shot another another missile. Another Dr. Epic Fetus missile. Another Dr. Epic Fetus missile. What's that? Uh, let's see what's in here. Uh, okay, we got the Belial and also the both of which are completely useless to my build. So, let's keep going. Oh, come on, they, they spawn back? Did they change that in the... Yeah, maybe they changed that in the most recent patch. It's not a change that I like. Right, we got a full heart here. Actually, I should check really, really quickly how many hearts we have in there. Do they still work? Yeah, they do. Okay, we got a full heart here. Oh man, that's terrible. We have okay, so one, two, uh, Berg and Stout. I'm trying to keep numbers in my head while I. It's just, it's just the number two. Come on, it's not that, not that hard. Not that hard, bro. Okay. Um. So two hearts at least we can play the blood bank. Two and a half. Two and one half, okay. Awesome. Got some more money to look for some more keys. I'm gonna go back and get these hearts over here, firstly. Uh, I don't know what they are. How many there are? Okay, so there's a half. So we can play it half more times already. Um, let's see what else we got here. What does we got over here? Okay, so we can play it one full heart more times. Oh, I got a key. Where did I get a key from? I don't even know, man. I don't even remember. I don't even remember. I would like a second key. The reason that I would like a second key is because I would love, um, I would really, really, really like to go to the library because the library doesn't always only drop books. It also has the potentiality for dropping, oh, you know what? Let me just go to the shop. My reasoning 
He's very sound. My reasoning is this. Um, I'll go to the shop. If it doesn't have anything I like, I'll buy a key and go to the library. But if it does have something I like, I'll buy it. And then I'll use the rest of my money to uh, pay into the fortune teller because uh, fortune tellers are good. Also, it's it's pretty likely here that we're going to fight greed. Yeah, I kind of kind of saw that. So that's all right. Um, we'll use a lot of this money to uh, purchase. Um, no, we, we got a key so we can go to the library, which is good. Um, yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna purchase some stuff at the fortune teller. Figure on out what's going on at him. Uh, hopefully, he has a. Yeah, you know, crystal ball. Maybe I would trade out the uh, Book of Revelations for a crystal ball. I don't know, man. Yeah, look. Got uh, Bloody Lust, which is, you know, useless. Because I don't think I get a damage up on, on Doctor's Remote. But whatever. Uh, yeah, it ain't so bad. That ain't so bad, yo. I'll blow this up. Yep. Two coins. Cool. I will uh, play you for a. Uh, I will play you down to the 25 uh, cents. Okay. You know what? Maybe I'll pay you down to 23 cents. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have blown up the heart machine. Maybe I'm a big dumb guy. Maybe I don't know anything. Luck up. Okay. That's cool. I should keep playing here. All right, down to 20 cents, I'll play it. 20 cents. I'm looking for a key. That's what I want. No such luck. All right, well, then uh, we'll go over here, pay him a bunch of money, uh, however much, until he gives me something good, at least. Oh, he's spades. Uh, that, I don't know, increases our power card drops or something? Oh, Goat Hoof does nothing for us. That's going to be nigh impossible to pick up any of this stuff. Alright, we got our blue heart. Uh, good enough. What do I want? I want... No, I want the child's heart. Nope, give me the child's heart. Where's the child's heart? Was I holding the child's heart? Where? There it is. Okay. Get out of there. Alright. Crisis averted, kind of. Oh, that was close. Move on to the next floor. That was enough gambling that I feel comfortable uh, continuing here. I would like another key, again, as as usual, because um, I would really like to go to the shop on this floor since it's most likely not greed. Um, in honesty, I oh stop it, stop doing this to me. No, I want to move. Oh man. You know, it only starts doing it when we get to the later floors also, which is great. Because that's, you know, that's what I need to dodge least. Okay, this room again should be no no reason that I uh, that I take any damage here. Uh, side note, I don't know if you guys like sports games or not, but uh, I'm pretty, well, you know, we're, we'll, we'll find keys if we really have to. Whoa. Right, right, right. Okay, cool. Oh, we got the key anyway. Um, got the Book of Revelations. I'm not going to fight Mom right away, obviously, because I want to go to the shop. And I think the shop is probably the better bet right now. Uh, because, you know, again, it could have a key inside for us to buy and then go to the treasure room. And also, I want the compass. Um, the compass, I think, would be the best upgrade that I can get right now. Better than anything that a treasure room could hold for us. Because, I mean, a lot of things that the treasure room could give us... Okay, awesome, we can go to both anyway. Um... A lot of things that the treasure room could give us anyway are, uh, are like damage ups and stuff, and uh, you know that's 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 borderline worth it. Got a got a heart machine here. Uh, maps close enough. I can deal with it. I'll pick up this key as well. Um, might as well use this once, right? <laughs> Blood banks. I, I don't think they've paid out for me one single time that I have used them in any of these videos. And also in the off-camera videos that I've done. Never paid out for me. Oh, another key. Maybe I shouldn't have bought that key. Whatever, it was three cents. I don't care about my decisions in the past. Wow, lots of keys. Okay. Um, toothpicks. Increase our fire rate, uh, which is, you know, okay, I guess. 
At least it just makes our eyes look weird. It's not going to do anything for Doctor's Remote, I don't think, at least. Um, and yeah, I'll play this a couple times because it could give me some blue hearts, and blue hearts, of course, are invaluable. Um, and I, I guess there's no reason for me to explore really the rest of that area there. Push pin, I don't know what it does. I'd rather have the hearts. Uh, the devil and death. Well, the devil would be nice to use. Oh, god damn it. Uh, the devil would be nice to use on. Well, no, it wouldn't because, right, like, like I was saying, damage ups, they don't do anything. Never mind! Also, side note, I think maybe I glitched the game by getting the Polaroid because it seemed like it was harder for most people to get the Polaroid. I don't know. Cancer increases our fire rate. Alright, none of those things are worth, worth anything for me. So, uh, uh, I'm gonna look around kind of for the secret room. I don't really want to find it that much. I mean, what was it gonna give me, really? Uh, blow that up. Wow! Oh, come on! See? You see how it keeps shooting? Okay, so we have three and a half hearts here. Ugh. I might as well open this up, right? Eh, look, a blue heart. That's what I was hoping for. Um, so I undid my horrible mistake. Three and a half hearts. Wait, so three and a half hearts. That's four hearts there. Uh, five hearts. Uh, so it's five and a half hearts, I think. I don't know if my math is being done right. Yeah, six hearts, seven hearts. Wow, seven hearts. Seven seven plays of this. I don't have any <laughs> I don't have any money left. Oh, okay, there we go. Let's go let's go see what the blood bank has for us. So we have seven, right? Seven seven plays. It's pretty ridiculous. I mean, let's see. You know, I said this never pays out. Let's see. You want to see what my luck has in, in store for us here? Wow, never mind. Awesome. So we got the blood bag, which actually didn't give us full health, which is kind of weird. Um, but I will play this machine a little bit. Uh, that's enough of that. Play it down to 10 cents. Eh, yeah, life steal. Play it down to 5 cents. Okay, never mind, I don't care. And I'll go see what's in the library before I go on and fight mom here. I don't really care to look for. Eh, none of those are worth it. Okay, we're gonna go fight mom. I don't really care about getting uh, to super full health because. Eh, never mind, I guess I do. Fight mom, see what's going on, what she has to say for us. That's unlucky. Alright, oh! Oh, I just hit the eye. Alright, so we have uh, Cat of Nine Tails, which is shot speed up, which is, you know, again, pretty basically useless, but whatever. Uh, we have so much health. We have so much health. We got two full health pills. Uh, maybe not full health, I mean health up pills. So that's awesome. Um, you know, I guess I'm going to explore this way. The reason I'm going to explore this way is because I can use this secret room as a quick... Okay, we got uh, Ankh, which is eternal life. I don't know what that does, really. Um, so, uh, again, I was going to use this as a way to skip through and see if this is the right path to, uh, to the boss. It could be. It is reasonably possible. And it is. Awesome. I am super smart. I'm like the smartest guy ever. Did you guys know that? I actually got Smartest Guy Award. Speaking of Smartest Guy Award, Nobel Peace Prize. How useless is that award now, right? Give it to any anybody. Anytime a new president is uh, is formed, uh, formed. Anytime a new president uh, like makes a speech, just give him a, give him a peace prize. I think like the last three presidents got Nobel Peace Prize. Uh, okay. Just gotta be smarter here, and the anticipation I'm still not being smarter. Okay, now. 
Okay, cube me. I'm gonna say it's probably Krampus here. Nope, it's not. It's uh, Sacrificial Heart, Sa Sacred Heart, Tears Up. Wow, that's awesome. I think that also gives me flight or something. I don't know. It's cool. Oh, I think it gave me a health up. I think that's what it was. I don't know. I don't even know, man. But uh, I don't. I don't really care. I'm. I'm gonna go this way. I, I'm gonna be honest. I don't think it's this way because it is a short path, and the game doesn't like to give you short paths to bosses. But I'm. I'm gonna be honest. Um. Oh, only two shots on the cloth will kill him. I'm cool with that. Bob's rotten head. Worthless. I mean, not worthless. It's a good item. Um, it's just not that great for me right now, considering I have uh, book revelations. I mean, why would I ever get anything else, huh? Uh, and we'll, we'll keep going here. Um, it could be down, I guess, too. But again, because of that same reason, it's a short path. I don't think it's going to be this way. I almost hurt myself there, uh, which is scary. Oh, yep, yeah, that was those that was, that was, uh, bad decisions, and I actually couldn't move that time. But luckily, I didn't take any damage. So that's off. Oh, freak me in the mouth. Eat my butthole. And call me Sally. Oh, get out of there. Alright, I hate that room. And the reason I fought in that room and didn't bomb my way out is because I fear that this is not the right path. And if, in fact, it is not the right path, which it's not, um, I would love to... What? How did that not kill you? Yeah, I would love to not have to fight it again, which I won't have to, luckily. So, uh, let's keep going here. Um, you know, I'm going to go down the way that I thought from the beginning it was now. Because I was being hopeful before. And, uh... Surprise, surprise, I bet it's not going to be this way, but, you know, whatever. Uh, Book of Revelations! Fantastic! Great upgrade. Epic Fetus, great upgrade. But I get it all every gosh darn video, so that's a health up, isn't it? Yep, it is. That is awesome. That is really cool. That is good things. Yep, see, it's been this path this whole time. I knew it from the beginning. I don't know why I didn't go here. Whatever, man. Oh, these, these guys are going to be annoying. Are you kidding? There we go. All right, let's fight uh, It Lives. Okay, this should be uh, super easy. I don't foresee this being very difficult, to be perfectly honest. Oh. Yeah, they're Monstro. I don't need none of your nonsense, Monstro. Get all those burn marks on the ground from my bombs going off. Oh, almost hurt myself there. Almost got hurt by a bomb there. Awesome. And uh, dropped a blue heart, which is great. So, I'm playing as Kane now. You know, I'm going to go up to the cathedral. Here's my reasoning. Remember I said in the beginning how... Um, Might, yeah, I'm gonna bomb my way out of here. Because even though it's not particularly hard, ah, I'm gonna take damage. Um, sorry. So remember when I said in the beginning of the video uh, that the reasoning that I would do this, go up to the cathedral instead of uh, things, is because I'm doing like Doctor Phoebus, where he's, where Isaac's not gonna be firing, or actually technically Blue Baby is not going to be firing uh, a lot of shots. Um, and not as much as he would be normally. Um, because I'm only hitting him with like like short, sm small, packed bursts of damage. So, uh, so yeah, I think this is probably going to be the easier boss. I'm hoping at least this will be the easier boss. At least this, this didn't screw me over and... Uh, and have a room full of enemies, angel, angel fetuses, and I hurt myself, but that's alright, because it's still only one heart anyway, um, so it's not like I, I did extra damage to myself, and a uh, flat penny, um, useless, I'd rather have the child's heart, because it just keeps dropping, wow, double widow, great, yeah, no, I like this, this is, this is fantastic, but I guess, uh, double widow is super easy when you have, um, 
We need to have epic fetus. Sorry, I just almost threw up in my mouth a little bit. Um, I, I don't, I don't think it was from the widow being disgusting, but uh, I, I suppose it's possible. I mean, it didn't happen. Oh. I actually thought I was going to take damage there. And luckily I did not. So we'll keep exploring. Open up this chest. I got some more money. That is, again, probably useless unless we run into a judgment bum greed. Uh, yep, that's not so bad. Let's see what's going on in here. I would probably not... Yeah, I, it, there would be almost no reason for me to... Uh, to go... Oh, there's a blue rock in here? And it gave me a gold chest. Get out of here. Get out of town! Um, and I guess I'll use death on Isaac. And my thinking is, I'll use it once all of the all of the, his flying fetus friends are out. It sounds like a Saturday morning cartoon show on like the the horror network. <laughs> uh, but yeah. So like when all his uh, all of his fetus friends are out, Isaac and his fetus friends. Um, maybe. Whoa. Maybe it'll be a little bit easier. Hey boy, you wanna you wanna do something here? Oh, wow. I forgot Meat Boy is going to make my life a lot harder by producing him, but I guess I'm gonna keep going with this. Um I guess he's not making it harder. He's making it easier in a way. Yeah, I haven't fought this enemy with uh, without Epic Fetus yet. Uh, I'll use death. Did I kill him? No, almost. Not really. Didn't even do any damage. Whatever. Um yeah, I've never fought this boss without Epic Fetus. Oh, we got Abel. Abel has appeared in the basement. Awesome. So, uh, we win. Hooray! Here's our ending again. Oh, that's a nice little stretch going on. And I like it. Which is nice, because the game's been screwing me for a while. But it didn't that time, so I'm happy. Um, so this has been Alpaca Patrol, signing out. Hope you enjoyed. Peace, fools.